Hello children. Today we are going to learn how to draw human ear. Human ear is a sense organ which helps in hearing and maintaining body balance. Human ear consisted of three parts, outer ear, middle ear, inner ear. So let us draw the structure of the human ear. First, let us draw the pinna which collects the sound wave and direct them into the auditory canal. So children, draw the pinna like this. Inside the pinna, you just draw a S-shaped curve. So this pinna, it collects the sound wave and direct them into auditory canal. Now draw the auditory canal. So just make a curve line like this. This is the auditory canal. Auditory canal prevent dust, uh, the hairs are present in the auditory canal, prevent dust particles to enter and wax which is produced in the auditory canal entangle small organisms and the dust. Now draw the important part of the ear, outer ear that is the tympanum. So that is also called as eardrum. This tympanum separate external ear from middle ear and sound waves make tympanum to vibrate. Now let us draw the second important part of the ear that is the middle ear. It consisted of the three small bones. The first one is malleus. It is also called as suttige in Kannada. It is just like hammer. So draw a structure which looks like hammer. Second smallest bone of the middle ear is incus which is just opposite to that of the malleus. So draw the structure like this. Third smallest bone is called it is called as stapes or it is also called as stirrup. So stirrup is like this. Draw the small th third smallest bone of the middle ear like this. So all the three bones are attached to each other. The vibration of the tympanum it is transmitted by the movement of these bones. So these three bones they form the middle ear that is the malleus, incus and the stapes. Now the third part of the bone uh, ear is inner ear. The inner ear it consisted of upper part it is called as utriculus. This utriculus it consisted of three semilunar canals. So draw the three semilunar canals like this. Lower part of the inner ear is called as the sacculus and it has an appendage called as the cochlea. Draw the cochlea like this. So this is the cochlea. The function of the uticulus and the sacculus is they maintain balance of the body. Now from here draw the auditory nerve. Cochlea contain the receptor which join together to form the auditory nerve. Now children to maintain the air pressure on the either side of the tympanum there is a tube that is called as eustachian tube. So draw the eustachian tube. So this is the structure of the ear. Now let us make it more beautiful by just shading like this. So children shade the pinna like this to get the 3D dimension of that. Draw the hair in auditory canal which prevent the organisms and the germ dust entering the 
auditory canal and wax which is produced in the auditory canal it entangles the dust just to shade the three bones malleus incus and stipes and semilunar canals Now let us label the parts. This is pinna, auditory canal, eardrum or tympanum. This is eustachian tube. Middle ear consisted of three small bones. First one is malleus, second bone this is called as incus, third bone this is called as stepes and the three semilunar canals Then this is the auditory nerve. And this is the lower part of the inner ear that is cochlea. So this is your human ear which will be asked for 4 mark question.